Hey guys, so this is sort of like a video response to Erin at Waiting Moose. Uh, she has a Goodreads group called Serial Killers, and I'll link it in the description below. Uh, but basically, she uh, is trying to round up more people to figure out what to do with the group and list what series you're reading or what you want to read. So I thought I would use this opportunity to leave a video record of the series that I own that I would like to read more of. So this isn't in any order, I just have it randomly stacked around me. Uh, first one is Ringworld by Larry Niven. This is a classic science fiction novel that my boyfriend really likes. And the Ringworld series I know has several books, I don't know how many, but yeah, there's that one. Now this one, The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo series by Stig Larsson. I read the first three and as you may know, the author died before it was published. And so someone else picked up the rest of the series, David Lagerkrantz, and he has the girl in the spider's web. So I want to continue on with the series to see if I like it or not. I really liked the Millennium Trilogy. That was really cool. Then I have a trilogy, um, the Mad Adam Trilogy by Margaret Atwood. The first book is Oryx and Crake, which I have read and I really enjoyed it. I read it my first year of college. I read the second book, The Year of the Flood, which I got signed by Margaret Atwood, so that's pretty cool. And then I have the third book called Mad Adam, which I have not read yet. So I don't know why I haven't gotten to it, because I really enjoyed Oryx and Crake and The Year of the Flood. I'm currently reading the Expanse series by James S. A. Corey. The first book is Leviathan Wakes. This is a science fiction space opera about um, the future where humans have colonized uh, some asteroids, the moon, and Mars. And there's, you know, spaceships and everything like that, and it's good. The books are pretty hefty, so this is the first book, and I'm currently reading Caliban's War. This one right here. And I'm only that far in. Oh, what page am I on? 235. So it's a bit of a chunker, but it's really good. And there's a TV show to go with it. Uh, so I recommend checking that out if you're into that. Then moving on to fantasy. I have the Legend of Drizzt series by R.A. Salvatore. The first one is called Homeland. And I read this one, and it was pretty good. It was uh, very accessible, easy to read fantasy book. Um, it's not one that's loaded down with lots of names and places that you know give you a headache when you read it. It was just very accessible and easy and fun to read. So the second book is called Exile, so I need to read that one. And I have um, six of the books in that series. For the Expanse series, I have also six in that series, so there we go. Okay. Now, speaking of accessible fantasy books, this one is not. It took me three tries to read this first book for A Tale of the Malazan Book of the Fallen by Steven Erickson. The first book is called Gardens of the Moon. And yeah, it took me, well, this book is about 650 pages. It took me three tries to get through it, and I'm still not sure that I understood everything. It was a lot of plot points starting all in one book and not really sure where they're going with that. So I started reading the second book, it's also a huge chunker, which is Dead House Gates. And I made it to chapter 6, which is page 211, and that's when I stopped because I was lost. So I need to restart this one from the beginning um, when I don't have so much on my mind. And then I saw um, Mom to Triplets, uh, Laura, or Lauren, sorry I don't remember your name. Um, she started reading this book and I realized that I had it on my shelf too. And I didn't know it was a part of a series, so I guess it counts. It's The Pillars of the Earth by Ken Follett. And this is the copy that I have, it has a picture of him on the back. Um, but yeah, those are my series that I have so far. I have some other books that are first ones in a series that I haven't read yet, um, like Pillars of the Earth, 
but for the most part these are ones that I've started that I want to continue on with. So if you have read any of these series let me know what you think of them and if you have any to recommend uh, please let me know in the comments below. Okay thanks guys see you later.